put this on and it connects to the backpack computer right here. This head mounted camera is driving the face of this character right there. So uh, we have uh, given this demo today because uh, it was the uh, Game and Media Technology uh, Introduction Day and uh, I'm the program coordinator of the Game and Media Technology Masters and the director of the Motion Capture and Virtual Reality Lab. They, they uh, put on the suits uh, as well, uh, one for the VR uh, application and one for the fully immersive uh, motion capture system. Uh, and then uh, they uh, showed us how they can actually uh, impersonate themselves with virtual characters in the game uh, engine. Uh, and the PhD candidate, uh, um, uh, Kazi, has shown us uh, the uh, different capabilities that is uh, possible uh, in the lab uh, in terms of research and as well as the education. Like this, straight, uh, stand straight and hand like this. You do with the other. And uh, this is a motion capture studio actually which is used uh, by uh, game studios and uh, visual effects industry. So a lot of, of the movies uh, such as Avatar for example that you see uh, in the movie theaters, they use that type of technology uh, to create realistic animations for characters as well as uh, AAA, AAA games for example. First of all, my bachelor is in uh, CS, computer science, so I have the background to come and uh, I'm playing video games from uh, when I was really young, so I really love video games and it's a passion, so it's what I want to do in my life, so yeah, yeah. I think it's going to help me uh, continue with my uh, studies and then my work. Uh, ik wil nadat ik klaar ben met de master wil ik, een, uh, wil ik aan game engines gaan werken. Dat lijkt me echt een hele vette baan om te hebben. De meeste games worden niet helemaal vanaf nul gemaakt, maar die gebruiken een game engine om ervoor te zorgen dat alle basisonderdelen zoals uh, uh, hoe zet je objecten op het scherm, hoe bewegen die, de, de, uh, de physics erachter, dus dat is de, de zwaartekracht, springen, dat soort dingen. Dat zit allemaal daar al ingebakken, zodat je eigenlijk alleen maar uh, Nee, maar game specifieke dingen hoeft te doen, zoals hoe ziet het eruit, uh, wat praten de karakters, wat, wat doen de karakters bij eigenlijk. Convergence of AI technologies and also XR, like including VR, uh, AR, extended reality. Uh, this combination will be the future. Um, a lot of, of the uh, European countries, including the Netherlands, is investing a lot uh, in this direction at the moment, both from an educational perspective, also for research perspective. Uh, virtual more. reality, yeah, we can see right now it's going really fast. We see Meta giving uh, too much funding, so everybody is trying to get in this game. So we can see the VR glasses from uh, Apple too. It's just it's uh, something uh, surreal uh, and you see now in New York people going around with uh, VR glasses but yeah I think it's yeah. gonna go really far we have to see <laughs>